Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. I'm Brandon Wirtz, and I'm here with... John Mormile. And your role at HP is? Product marketing for performance-optimized data centers. And we're standing in the EcoPod, but it has a more official name. Sure, the more formal name is the HP Pod 240A. And this is a deploy on demand infrastructure with housing, like. Absolutely, and it's the, basically it's the ultimate in converged infrastructure. We're designing a, and delivering a turnkey data center with all the power, the cooling, the networking, management and monitoring systems, uh, and deploying it as an end to end uh, turnkey solution. And you can deploy this anywhere. It like would work in the Arctic Circle and Death Valley and anywhere in between. Toledo, Timbuktu, or um, Tobago. Um, you're always going to be optimized for efficiency and for capacity. The air conditioning systems with the adaptive cooling automatically optimizes for the environment and the IT load to make sure again that we're delivering optimized capacity as well as efficiency at all times. And it would work like. You told me earlier that it's wind rated to 140 miles an hour or something like that? Sure, absolutely. The, the structure is rated. Uh, it's a NEMA 3 construction, so it's, it's built to be put outdoors. Um, we can withstand very high temperatures as, very, as well as very low temperatures, so negative 20 degrees Fahrenheit up to 130 degrees uh, Fahrenheit, as well as some, some pretty high wind ratings. It's, it's tested to uh, Dade County certification, so we've got wind ratings up to 150 miles an hour. So it's definitely a permanent structure and is designed designed to, uh, to withstand the elements. And, and that is your target market, is that you're really going to, you could deploy on demand and move this around, but you're looking at it as a long-term investment for companies as well. So instead of just building a huge building and hoping to sell out the capacity, I can do something where I buy these and deploy them a little at a time? Absolutely. I mean, this truly is um, capacity on demand or, or pay as you grow. You don't have to worry about your traditional way of building out data centers where you, you plan for your growth in the future and have to have a, a lot of sunk costs and, uh, and inflexibility with your capital investments. Here, because we're able to deliver the Pod 248 or EcoPod um, in a very short amount of time, in three months, which is fully configured and, and pre-tested, uh, customers know and can feel confident that they can deploy the capacity that they need and reserve that additional wasted spend that they would normally do with a traditional facility and use that for other parts of their business, R&D, putting out new products, um, hiring new employees, and things like that. And what kind of infrastructure do I have to bring to the pod? Do I, you know, what do I plug in to make this all go? Sure. So really, all you have to do is add power and network. Um, because we have integrated direct expansion, which are air-cooled refrigerant-based AC systems, and integrated power distribution, all you have to do is really bring in some incoming power and network. Um, because we do ship it pre-configured and pre-tested, literally you just hook it up and it's ready to go in a matter of uh, in a matter of weeks. Very cool. And this would work. You know, even in like Silicon Valley where we've got earthquakes and all kinds of, of badness that way as well? Sure. Um, basically what we do is we work with design build firms and construction firms to make sure that the site is prepped um, for the conditions that are uh, where it will be installed locally. Um, so, it, you know, we do anchor in our racks and, and things like that. And again, it is a, it is a very solid structure um, and it can withstand a lot of, uh, a lot of external elements. And then this is a nicer apartment than I had in Silicon Valley for the most part. Um, so I could, you know, buy one of these and have my servers in the, the next the next room, or is the cost a little more prohibitive than for personal use? Sure. Well, that that would be an interesting application. Um, we've designed this obviously for for high performance IT, but um, you know, when you talk about the capital investment, we really we can deploy this actually at a quarter of the cost of, of building a traditional brick and mortar data center. So let me give you an example: um, building a a 1.2 megawatt um, IT capacity facility at a tier three construction level or a tier three redundancy level, excuse me, would run you anywhere from. 20 million to just north of, of 30 million dollars uh, to build that facility and and again that's a facility just at capacity. Traditionally, when you build out facilities, you build out much more, much larger than you need um, for future growth and things like that. So your cost could be uh, much higher than that. But deploying this type of solution, um, you're able to, again, scale uh, at the capacity that you need and pay as you grow. So deploying this solution of a pod, uh, redundant generators and UPSs, and installed 
would be just under $8.5 million, somewhere around $8.3-ish million. So it's a tremendous capex savings, and you're looking at about uh, approximately 75% uh, savings over brick and mortar. Wow, that's a very impressive product. Thank you for your time today. Thank you.